Hi guys, it's Jessalyn with me and my nuclear family. I'm going to do another Dollar Tree haul. Um, I've been doing a swap and I have some friend mails give, um, going. Um, a couple of them going right, right now all synchronized. Um, and I'm trying to get as much shopping done and as much Dollar Tree items that I can find um, that I can send away in my um, friend mail. Um, but let's go ahead and get started. So I'm just going to pull them out. It won't be in any particular order. I'm just going to pull them out in the bags. Um, I went and I saw these and I bought five of them. They're the weed barriers and I thought that I'd pick them up for my house. Um, my new home that we built, I don't know, we built, that we just purchased. I don't know if you guys have um, heard, but me and my husband just purchased our first house. And these are going to go, I plan on doing a, a small garden, well, a decent sized garden in the back of our house, which once I do a home tour... You'll see, I, I wanted to do raised garden beds, but because it already has the perfect spot, it's um, it's got bricks that it's um, kind of elevated in. I plan on going ahead and doing all my um, gardening there. I'm going to have a little garden for Toby, so this is what I purchased those for. So I bought five of those. And then speaking of gardening, I picked up this... Um, little trowel, what is this? Yeah, little trowel with the pink handles. I had one that I had purchased from the Dollar Tree that had a wooden handle and it broke. You can see, I guess I was too hard on it. And then I got a cultivator, you know, the little claw. So I purchased that as well. Um, I also picked up one of these little bunny, people have been hauling these bunny faces. And gosh, I can't think of her name. I just watched her. I'm sorry, girl, I can't think of your name, but you said that you had to look through all of them to make sure you the face wasn't ratchet. And I will say at my Dollar Tree, they were all really cute looking. So there was hardly any ones that looked all janky. So this one was a really cute one. I'm going to put this on the inside of my house. I just, I actually hung it up and then I pulled it back down. And I was like, oh, I got to haul it first. So that's why I pulled that down. And then in this bag, I found these Create a Towns. I don't know if you've seen these before. I've hauled these many times before. Um, this one is the circus, um, and it's got the stickers included, so, and here's what they look like on the back. So it's literally a little town, and then you can go ahead and put the stickers wherever you like. Uh, I bought two of these, one for friend mail and then one, one for my collection. I will be using these stickers, actually, inside, um, of my, um, my crafting collection, so that's why I, I purchased two of them. Um, I, they also had one in the boutique, which I thought was so cute. So it's Create a Town, and it's got the little boutique and the stickers. Look at how cute they are, like clothing, little mannequin, and then little clothing on racks. So I thought that was really sweet. So I picked up two of those. Oh, I guess I only picked up one of those. Well, that's going to my collection. I picked up two of these train station ones, which I thought they were really cute. And then the stickers are right on the back. You can see it, Express Train, and there's like a little train right there. And then also I picked up the last of the Creative Town, and this one is the Pirate Theme, which look how cute that looks. All the stickers are included. It's really fun. You can actually take the stickers and pull them, peel them off and pull them back on. So it's, in my opinion, when I've tried them out, they actually work where you could reuse them. Maybe not a bunch of times, but you can take them off at least once. I picked up a three pack of these notebook cashiers. My husband took a different route and he actually needed to borrow um, one. He needed one of these and the one that I had had writing all in it. So I bought him a three pack of these. He only needs one of them, but it'll be good just to have on the side extra. I picked up these foam craft shapes for Tobias. We play, we, I call it sticker time, where I'll get like the, the stickers and then he'll stick them on um, the foam shapes. And then if I do like, I save the shapes, so I'll save these shapes with the decorations on them. And when I do like giveaway bags or, you know, like Christmas bags or whatever, Easter baskets or whatever, I, I glue them on um, just those little um, Dollar Tree bags that you can get two, three, four dollar. Um, so that way, a little bit of Tobias goes with the gift. And then I picked up two packages of the mini glue sticks because they were out for a long time. And I want to make sure that I have enough because, you know, can't beat them for a dollar. I picked up this bold gold color show for a swap that I'm doing. It's a beautiful color. I actually have this one myself already. I also found the one lonely little tape. Um, uh, washi tape. 
This is either going to go to friend mail or a giveaway. And then I picked up this tulip tie-dye kit in red. I know I, I hauled a bunch of the red and purples, but I picked up another one for friend mail. Now, I also for friend mail picked up this um, gift wrapping because I'm going to individualize each gift. And look how cute those are. Just It looks just so spring colored and I like them. So I'm going to be individually wrapping each gift with a little note. Um, like I see when I see on friend mail. So I'm like, that is such a great idea. Instead of throwing everything in the box, I want to put a little note attached as to why I purchased it. I also finally, finally found these biscotti bites. I only bought one package. For some reason, I, I'm kind of kicking myself. I should have bought two. But I got it in the caramel milk chocolate, the nonis. I heard they were good. I heard they weren't so good. So I'm going to give them a go myself. That's why I only picked up one. If I do like it, I probably will go back tomorrow and we'll get some more. I also picked up one of these transplanters for, to transplant stuff for my, um, my new garden that I'll be doing. Let's see. I also, for friend meal, picked up two of these little Easter bunnies in the blue. In, well, two. One of each. A, a blue and a green one for friend meal. I picked up three of these Hello Kitty eggs. One, two will be for friend mail and then one's going to go to my niece Ayana because I'm going to make her a little bag um, or a little, you know, I like to send every month um, something special to her um, just like from and a note from her auntie. So her auntie Jesslyn because I love her so much. But anyways, I picked up three bags of these hard candy spring mix lifesavers. These are so yummy and the flavors are strawberry, banana, raspberry, and watermelon, my favorite. So I will be keeping one of these and I will probably be putting them in an Easter basket, the rest of those. Um, I picked up, Angie Saves had picked these up, I believe, and I, and I, when I saw them, I thought that's a great idea. What she said was, you know, they, they still, they're, they're still within the time frame and they don't, they're don't they not expiring anytime soon. And it's good just to have the imitation almond extract because you never know when a, um, per her words, you never know when you're going to need just, you know, one teaspoon of it or tablespoon, you never know. And then the pure lemon extract. So thank you, Angie. Uh, when I saw them, I thought of you and I definitely picked them up for me. I also, I love this Tony Chagerie's Creole seasoning. When they when I see them, I always pick up one of these because this seasoning is really, really, really good. And you can tr use it on chicken, fish, everything. It's awesome. I picked up two of these alphabet beads. Um, one for my craft collection and one I'm going to send to my niece Ayana because, so she can make little friendship bracelets for her friends. That's what I thought of when I saw them. I picked up these multi-purpose clips these metal clips and these I like to use for um, like chips and cookie bags and stuff like that I bought two of those I also bought I found these cotton swabs in these little tin containers and this one is in the frozen this one's Olaf this one will go in Tobias's room because I hauled another one that was like around and I can't find it so I, I just picked up that and if I find it it's no worries because this I'll probably after all the q-tips are out of it I'll probably reuse it for something else like um, in my um, travel bag and then I also found it in the frozen girl so this one's going in my travel bag for sure I found these for friend mail and one possibly one for my niece. I'm not sure, but they're they say pretty. I, I didn't even haul these before. I don't think, and I got them both in pink, so I got two of these in pretty. And then I found two of these um, keychain badge holders, and they're for friend mail. Two people that I know that probably could really use these, so um, I'm going to go ahead and send those off. I found this foot lotion tea tree oil so that way when I give myself a pedicure or rub my husband's feet, yes I do that once in a while because he's on his feet all day so I like to pamper him sometimes and, and give him a massage. You know I'm an esthetician, we, we do some form, we have been trained in some element of um, massage so yes I like to spoil my husband sometimes. Moving on, I found this really cool lip gloss and it's in a monkey head, see that little monkey? So I'm going to put that in my little collection for um, my lip glosses. I also found these shuttle pens. They're the little um, stylus design. And this is actually going in a friend mail to um, one of my subscribers in particular. She just did a video on, um, on her, what's it called, uh, day planner. And I thought this would be perfect for her. So I picked that up for her. So that's going in a friend mail. 
Oh, I guess I picked up four bags of these, so this will be going in a card mail. Um, I also picked up for um, Solange. This was for you. That's who I was talking about. You, girl. This is going to you. And I also picked you up. I picked up two of them. I know you were talking about you didn't see the um, um, St. Patrick's Day stickers. So I found two. They're the same. But I found these stickers for you. So I picked them up for you, girl. I'll be sending those in your um, friend mail just so you know. Be on the lookout for that. That's for SB Designer. Be on the lookout for her channel. She's awesome. She does a lot of reviews on Bath and Body Works candles and the little clamshells and she's just got an awesome channel so you guys gotta go check her out. SB Designer. Um, I also picked up a, um, a little package of these white labels. They're just plain white. I know I had hauled them in, in different things. And then I picked up a bunch of these thank you cards. Um, I'm doing a swap with somebody and they wanted some thank you cards to see if there was any new ones out there. Um, so I picked up some because I needed some for myself as well. And I picked up a couple. Um, and I'll show you. So this one's for me. It's in this Tiffany blue. I thought it was so gorgeous. They only had one left. So I picked up one of these and it says thanks. And those are for my subscribers and for my friends and family. I picked up these. I thought these were so pretty for my friend mail. It says thank you. And it's got the brown and white polka dot. thought that is gorgeous. I picked up these. It says many thanks for being so nice of these really sweet birds. So I picked up two of these. I found one of these, thanks a, thanks a lot, what you did was so nice, just like you. And the little fox, I thought it was so cute. And then I um, picked up two of these, thank you very much, thank you cards. It was a, it was such a, a thoughtful gesture. I love the colors in them, I thought they were so pretty. So I picked up two of those, and those are going to be for friend mail, and then also for sending out. And then last, this is the last part of it, I picked up two of these Lisa Frank coloring books for friend mail. So two of these. I picked up this Strawberry Shortcake Hey It's Huck um, for my niece Ayana, so she has something in her package. I picked up this Scooby-Doo Jumbo Size um, coloring book, activity book for friend mail. And last but not least, oh, actually, I have one more after this. For friend mail, also this Funny Faces Robot Sticker Book. Look how cute that is, and it comes with stickers on the inside. So I thought that would be fun for my um, one of my YouTube sister's sons to play with. And then last but not least, look at this cool duct tape that I found. I thought that was such a cute little heart shape. I don't know if anybody's hauled these before. I hadn't seen them yet, but I thought these were really cool, and I'm going to be using this for friend mail and packages. So that is all for my Dollar Tree haul. I have another Dollar Tree haul coming up because I went to two different ones, and I had to break them down into two. I hope you guys like this video, and be on the lookout for giveaways coming up and friend mails and swaps. So I hope you guys are having a great weekend. Until I see you next time, I'm Jocelyn with me and my nuclear family. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.